I, I have to take you back to not the nine o'clock news. Oh, I knew you would. Oh, I have to. <laughs> Who wouldn't? Back to uh, back to was the nineteen eighty around there. That's where you met uh, your husband. Yes, Billy. Yes, I was I was uh, impersonating um, a well known presenter in the UK, Janet Street Porter. I don't think she's forgotten, forgiven me because <laughs> they keep playing that sketch where I was yeah. taking off. I had fake teeth in and and everything, and I was asking Billy, you know, if if people understood his accent, and, uh, <laughs> and then he said sorry because at that time everybody thought his accent was pretty pretty hard to understand. Yeah, so. <laughs> absolutely. Do you? I mean, that, it's such a it's such a legend. Such an iconic uh, time in entertainment. I mean, when did you realize that, that you know you were part of something like that? I mean, you also did a stint on on, on Saturday Night Live. Am I right? That's right. Yes. Oh, both amazingly iconic. Well, not the nine o'clock news was you know sort of crept up on us because we all thought that it was this weird little show that they were doing on BBC Two that everyone yeah. was a bit embarrassed about, and yeah. uh, you know, yes, we were the kind of the. Um, the, the the naughty kids sure, and of um, taking off the real proper big news on BBC One. But you had fun, right? But we had fun, and then of course suddenly it took off, and then you know it was it was mm. kind of a monster. Spawned some uh, very very funny uh, parodies like. <laughs> what goes to your mind when you hear that? <laughs> I think I was sort of sitting on a sheep at one point. That was yeah, very well. that's right. It, it, it was um, that was Olivia Newton-John, wasn't it? Yes, yeah, physical. Yes, I know. Let's get physical. physical. But yours, typical, bloody typical. Well, the trouble is that you know I've, I've parodied so many people, you did. and including on Saturday Night Live. And when I was on Saturday Night Live, I parodied parodied Billy Idol. I did a bit whole Billy Idol thing. Did you? And then cut to a few years later when I was had kids and I was. Um, Sort of having to drive them to school in California, and they and at the school they they gave you other kids in the street that you had to carpool with, and I ended up carpooling with Billy Idol's kids. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, um, sorry about yeah. that. <laughs> Hi, remember me? <laughs> Madonna too, and it was just you know a lot of so Cindy Lauper. Oh it was like, yes. All right, you run into them. It's like. <laughs> <laughs> what do they say to you? <laughs> well, uh, you know, usually, I mean, I find that the most common thing is for them to like be above it, you know, sort of pretend that it never happened. Sure. And, um, and, and they sometimes they'll, 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 they'll bring it up and, and sometimes I'll just say, oh, you know, I hope you enjoyed, you know, my tribute. Because I'll, <laughs> <laughs> ah, you know, one man's parody oh, is see. another man's tribute. That's so. it. I must remember that. <laughs>